we swing first stop is a cow gone for the big shot straight away gets a top edge and gets a boundary to open his account not fully in control of, of that shot there was space there was bounce wanted to pull it takes the top edge but it's counted as four runs that's the most important yeah, you can picked up sweetly just clears the field in that mid-on position he'll get four another boundary for Ezekiel good positive cricket the intention is to go for runs game of the toe edge of the bat fully it was not fully middled but still enough legs to clear that in a circle runs away for four runs enough bat just splices this one behind point it finds the gap he has a clear role and he's playing with a plan he is the aggressor in this opening partnership getting the innings off to a flyer stays quite low and throws his hands to the ball quick hands there still not full in control but effective very effective in the power play tyrus there he goes again more of the middle of the bat fielders giving chase but they can't catch it three falls in a row to end the second 18 without loss that's how you play to your role fearless cricket here and he's taking the attack to one of the best bowlers to in the opposition that definitely puts doubt in the opposition mind good positive batting there Pardon, Raiders. More timing than anything else. That's what we've seen from Habibullah. Very different to Isakel. Just pass that feeling short, fine leg. This is good going, scoring on both sides of the wicket. Trouble here for this Marden team. There was a change in feel because of the last shot to cover. Fine leg comes in and then he strays down the leg side. Not good bowling there, but good awareness with the bat. All he had to do was touch the bat with the ball and there were four runs on offer. There he goes again. Should be taken. And it is taken. So we talk about uh, high risk when you're so ultra aggressive in your approach. He pays the heavy price and loses his wicket. First wicket down for the Rao Pindi. He was lucky in the last over, attempted a similar shot, went for four to third, not this time. The ball got big on him, went up in the air and a very good catch, running backwards, safe hands of Hasib Khan Abidullah gets the first breakthrough Isa Khail has to walk back for 16 Rawalpindi Raiders 25 for 1 Ali Haider making the call one of the two presiding umpires up and away was in the slot there was wit on this one all he had to do was sink that back leg get under it found the right elevation and produces 4 for his team Habibullah showing what he can do. You can see his approach a bit cautious, but on a free hit, he opens up his arms, connects well for four runs. Some lines. Good fielding. Rates of 100 stop. You look at the best, sir. We continue with Emil Khan now from the pavilion end. It's 
quiet, the batter up, they are going for an appeal. They look very confident. Seems like they are going for the review. Wahad's the bat on strike. There was a hint of away movement. He was flicking across the line. Didn't make contact. It does look like there was a deflection. You can see the move, the seam moving, but we'll see what the third umpire thinks. No conclusive evidence to suggest that there was an outside edge. Last ball of the over. Gone short. And just sufficient bat to evade that field in full slip. Unfortunate for Emil. Concedes four after 5.37 for one. Magnificent snake. Oh, I could watch this over five times. You gave me a heart attack. <laughs> well, why not? Look, have a look at this. Brilliant. That's a good catch. I think the second one that by a keeper who liked one yesterday and one this he was uh, having more weight on his left foot and suddenly improvised and dived and the timing was so right about that dive they need to pull off such catches in order to win this match they're defending a low total here Habibullah gone for 15 Ralph Pindy 37 for 2 9 dots for Bahaj he's probably thinking how do I find a single here there, just like that. A single ends the power play. 40 for two, Raul Pindi Raiders. 